I got a flashlight. Okay, that's fine. I can use the flashlight. Um, you want to know the funny thing? There's only like two things I really, I mean, I looked at the glass, but there's only two things that I picked up to really look at. This was one. Right. And this is good also. Yeah, you did really good. Flat. Yeah, for 20 bucks, we did good. I, I think I have 75 to at least $100 here. And I have um, the same. These are signed by Moni Wilson. And I think that's five on the bottom. It could have been a date, but I was like, are these five? Um, they're pa paper mache and felt uh, Halloween sculptures. And this is what this person does. That, right? You looked at... Uh, you looked at her, her her art, and she seems to to make Halloween. Like here's a witch. The other one's a pumpkin head. Um, it's pretty cool. Again, signed Moni Wilson. M O N N I E. Uh, I don't know. Does that say thirty? I don't know. Looks. I just whatever. I paid ten for the two. This has a little damage here or there, but I still believe we can get easily seventy five to hundred for these. And it's just, I was looking at all the stuff, and I picked them up, and I was like, oh, they're signed. Let me look at this. This, I don't know if you've seen these before. Um, unfortunately, glass. these are glass. They, I know they uh, they might look like like uh, plastic, but this is uh, Murano Italian glass. And this these, unfortunately, do you remember what the clasp looks like? Yeah, it's a round, it's just a round clasp. Sometimes it's, uh, it's, Possibly sometimes it's replace the same... Them type of glass beads yeah like a little like a miles just around and sometimes it has a s on it for archimedes seguso right so basically these these were made uh, by archimedes seguso they come in different colors they made them for chanel he made and, them for and chanel. they made them for, for chanel um the the designer and these are look to be in pretty good shape yeah, just that the clasp is missing. And missing the clasp, also, which is it's, insane. It's but... a gold-flecked glass, too. Yeah, these we haven't had ones like this. We've had two set, two so far, right? I, and I don't know if I sold them both. I had a, one that was blue. Yeah. I sold that one. I don't remember You might have sold both because we had two, I remember, because you got the first one, you didn't know what it was, and you figured out what it was, you found another one. So this will be the I third one. I found a pair of earrings. That's it. You found. So you didn't the earrings find... earrings haven't sold. Okay, you didn't find the but necklace. But they're red, white, and blue. So that's a particular... Uh, Not patriotic, I guess. Yeah, it's like... Either somebody has to have the, the necklace to match... And well, they want the earrings to I match, think some or... people have, like, a, a pristine, perfect necklaces that they... I think they price them in, like, maybe as much as $1,000 each. Yeah, they put them in uh, But they seem to sell more, like, two to three. Well, or... I figure since it's missing its clasp... Sorry, I uh, You would have to put a new clasp on that. Yeah. Um... I should be able to get at least 75 well, Maybe you can get like a, a take a Chanel clasp off of something else. No, I'm not doing that. No, I don't mean me or you. That's for someone else. So actually, so that's not bad, you know, no. 20 bucks. Uh, maybe 200. Maybe 200. Not bad. Maybe more. You know, you never know um, what can happen. You might do better with these because of the color. Someone might like really like yeah, the color. Yeah, they might like the color. You know. All right. Um, there's two more sales to go to. Uh, we'll see if there's anything else good to buy. Okay, these were a buck a piece, so I bought them. Um, condition isn't really great on them. Some might be, like, bad, bad. But I will sell these at a... Like, this one, I'll sell it at a flea market. Like, three bucks. I don't care. I just flick something off of there. Um, they had the sale yesterday, too. I didn't... Uh, oh, they did? Okay. This one's signed. The Big Woods Alive. Bob Wyatt. Amy something... This guy, Billy, whatever. I'm sure their names are here. Yeah, Bobby Bigwood. The Bigwood, oh. Uh, Rob Wyatt and Bigwood cover sketch. Let me see what their music is. Freight Train, Irish Medley, Island in the Sun. Hopefully the record's not in horrible shape. Uh, either way, I guess they're Irish folk music. Rain dropsy calling on my head. Blah, 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 blah. Why can't I remember the second verse that? He's trying to sing it in an Irish accent. Uh, bread. I like bread. It's delicious. Uh, and the music is not half bad either. They're like easily, e easy listening. Uh, I don't know, Dan Hill. I just figured I'd get them. Here's the Doors. Actually, there were three Doors albums. Uh, they weren't in great condition, but... I just, mamas and papas, it's just, 
cheap music for the fleas. Uh, I never, uh, well, I know the turtles, so, oh, Golden Hit, so, turtles have a lot of great songs. Oh, here's one I immediately recognize. It ain't me, it ain't me, it ain't me, but I ain't fortunate, so. Uh, here's another Doors, Strange Days. I didn't look at this one, I just figured, ah, for a dollar, I'll just take a chance. I don't even have, like, a sleeve. Kind of the record. Young Rascals. Stephen Sill, Sills. Younger and, and thinner with more hair. Um, Steppenwolf, Steppenwolf Monster. <laughs> That's like a crazy. Those are like guys do. They just like take their shirts off and hang out. <laughs> like, what is this? All right. Uh, maybe they were playing a football game, Shirts vs. Skins. Um, Yellow, I like Yellow. They have a lot of great music. Telephone Line, Rockeria. Uh, a Living Thing, great song. It's a living thing to do. It's a terrible thing to do. Another Doors, Jim Morrison. Iron Butterfly. In the God of the Beat Cream, this is probably not worth a lot, but it's uh, it's psychedelic. And uh, psychedelic stuff is, 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 is awesome. Psychedelic. You gotta be on mushrooms to be able to focus and appreciate all this stuff. But yeah, that's it. Uh, now we're gonna get something to eat, then I'm going to the store. If I get anything good at the store, I will add it to this video. Otherwise, I'm out of here. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. I literally just have to comment on, on this. Now, I, I get it when you write your name on the album, right? But in, in my mind, it's like I have to think about what kind of place, uh, or whatever, wherever Janet Bailey lived, where she had to scratch her name well, think into a about record. It this way. They used I, to I mean, have parties back in the day where people your, would go to their friend's house and bring records. That's what and I'm maybe saying. Her records got stolen. I, like, what kind of friends are stealing her records? So, and what? Well, yeah, but you don't know who's inviting who. I, it's you just like you not know everybody there. Like, that's that's you got to live in the worst. Yeah, see, because she wrote her name on the cover, and right? But the, like, the you got to live with the ghetto. <laughs> you know what I mean? No. <laughs> like uh, the the worst neighborhood where you got to write your name. You got to scratch your name into the record. I mean, come on. It's like that's gonna hurt the value of the record. Who's this? Kim Bailey. Oh. Oh. Sisters. Oh, that's terrible. All right. Now I understand. I just thought, like, yeah, my friends steal my shit. You know, like, all your friends are on crack or they're doing heroin or whatever. And you're just like, where's my fucking workers, right? And it's like, we stole them because we needed money to buy crack. But no, it's sisters. That's my record! You know, you think they would know what they like. Unless well, they bought the same exact records, but whatever. Okay, bye. Shame, Phil we're Collins. He, he's just, he's very weak. Uh, it we're was a, a few weeks ago. I, it, it wasn't very long at all. Where? His, I think his son? Do you know where it was held at? Oh, I don't know. Uh, Mandalorian. We just got some pops in. These are trade in spider man. Nothing exciting here. Dr. Octopus. The guy decided to take the most valuable one with him. Unfortunately, Loki. And it wasn't even that. Hey, Post, Post Malone. Nice. I have a Post Malone t-shirt. Did, did I sell that Post Malone t-shirt? Captain America. I did. Oh, you're not sure. Gragu. Roman Reigns, and of course, Black Cat. That's that's everything that's coming today.